Hey guys, Clumsy here and welcome back to Tourist Bus Simulator. Thank you for all the comments, likes, and the feedback. And uh, for letting you know that you want the series to continue in more episodes. So here we are. We have a shuttle service today, a bit of a different uh, trip for our little bus right here. And uh, actually I forgot to clean it, man. That would not go well with the customers. Well, maybe they won't notice. But anyway, just to give you an update, we have been pretty busy. We have a lot of different uh, jobs that are booked. I'm trying to really maximize my drivers and uh, make the most out of them and the vehicles as well. Let me go and see. Oh, that has to be fixed first though. Oh my goodness, that's so bad. Uh, is isn't in the depot at the moment, but we'll see how we can fix that later on. How about this one? Okay, not that one either okay we'll uh, take care of that later but first let's go and look new orders we do have one here which we can take i think and we can have enno oh that's going to overload him okay that's not going to work all right uh they don't have anything then then we just leave it as is and we proceed with our job where we will be taking some folks from lalahita in the from Hotel Candela, just a short distance to La Paret in the surf, uh, the windsurfing beach, and then we'll wait because it is around 9 a.m. We'll wait a little, and then uh, in the afternoon, we'll pick them up again, bring them back to the hotel. So, a straight and easy shuttle service should not be very intriguing. Mahlzeit. Is das Ticket hier gültig? A uh, yes, you are in my list. Vielen Dank. Too bad we don't have a QR Morning. code thing. Kann ich mit diesem Ticket einsteigen? Like in Fernbus. Uh, no. Now we can just look at Servus. the company. Könnten Sie bitte mein Ticket kontrollieren? Maria Vasquez. Wait a minute. Why do we, why do we have two Maria Vasquezes? Is this an imposter? Is this a thing? There are two of you. I guess that must be a bug. Good morning. <laughs> is this ticket here correct? It is Thank correct. Like those two Hola. ladies, which have the same name. I let you battle Muchas that gracias. amongst yourselves. <laughs> Not going hey. to get in that. Puedo subir con este billete? Someone is copying someone. Can and I, uh, I will stay away Mucho from all gusto. that trouble. Podrías por favor revisar mi billete? Muchísimas gracias. At least we have a lot of different Jean languages Eric now. Sobier. This lady French. Sofia. The name doesn't sound so French though. Sofia Esposito. Merci. So Allo. Like Spanish. Ce billet est-il valable? Phoebe Thompson. Are you in our list? Yes, you are. Merci beaucoup. I think there are more there. models as well. Can I ride with this ticket? Yes. You Thank are you going with much. us. Can you guys still fit in? I know it's not such Hi. a large Darf bus. Ich mit but it's going to be get pretty cozy in there. Wait a minute. Francesca Rizzo. I might be able to just refer to the shuttle service, but I'm just making extra sure that we didn't miss anybody. The, the the guy or whoever prepared this list uh, will Merci hear bien. from me Salut. because they could have Je easily sorted this alphabetically. <laughs> Made my life easier. Merci bien. Salut. At this point, Salut. we'll have to do everything Salut. manually. My goodness, Pedro Torres, Merci. you are in our list. Puis -je avec ce billet? Mercedes Romero. Merci you are Hello. here. Can I ride with this ticket? No, that is with a different service. Off you go. Ce billet est -il valable? Jose Antonio Martinez. Merci beaucoup. Merci beaucoup. Uh, that Hello was there. not a French name for Could sure. You but check my ticket? Not judging. Not. It's Hi nice there. to see that they are Could walking towards the bus ticket? now, though. Much appreciated. Good. So everybody's here. They are all walking into the bus. And uh, now if we double check our passengers. How do we check that? I'm not sure, but I think everybody's good. 18 out of 18. Let's go and trust that list. 
Almost a full bus, but not quite. Just perfect for this trip, actually. Let's close that door. There you go. Nice. All right, off we go. I left the windows a bit open just for a bit more ventilation in there. Really like this shuttle. Not the best sounds, but everything else, it feels like the perfect size for the skimpy roads in this neighborhood. And uh, yeah, these are very small cities, very small towns. Can you imagine the usual Fernbus coaches turning through here? You would be bulldozing, hammering through all those different cars along the way. So you guys have been trying to guide me and uh, is it right that you have to go inside those restaurants to unlock them? It's not enough that you pass through them? It's gonna get pretty crappy, isn't it? Like that gym, I did unlock that, I did discover that rather by driving through them. Do I have to go down and enter there? It's a bit of a hassle, isn't it? But I guess it kind of makes sense because I think I did that once and it showed a restaurant unlock like one out of something. So I guess that is true. In a way. So it should be a pretty straightforward trip. That guy is waiting for us, thank you. And there shouldn't be any violent curves or bends. So we can go ahead and appreciate and enjoy the gentle bends and the relaxing routes, hopefully. That's the idea. But you know, with me driving, it's never a certainty. <laughs> so <laughs> we'll do our best. But no promises as always. <clears throat> One thing where this uh, bus is not very good at is speeding, getting speed. So it's not very apt for the highways like this one. I think the top speed of this guy is around 90 kilometers per hour. Let's see if we can floor it. You know, we can actually go 100. And yeah, look at that. We're almost there already. This is not going to be a long trip like the last time. Which is a good thing in a way. So we just have the right length of the episode here. We will see. Slow down to 60. Just tap on the brakes. And let it glide along smoothly like so. Perfect. Nice. I actually just came from here. I had to drive all the way there to the hotel offline before I started recording. And then I... But this is where he came from. I think the last job that we did, this is where we ended up in. And yeah, the, the finances are doing much better. We're earning our, around 100k in revenue. And we are spending around 30k in expenses. So all in all, net of 70 per period. I'm not sure how much, how long of a period that is. Don't enter the roundabout, thank you. Yes, if the trend continues, then we should be earning quite a bit. Thank goodness to the drivers that we have and the routes we've done. Now, I think I'll have to step up on the mechanic aspect because the, the buses are getting really hammered. Like you saw, one of the buses was in the yellow, like 60% or something. Lots of different uh, malfunctions and we don't want them to be driving with that kind of condition. So we'll have to think about how to properly service them so i ordered some extra parts i there are contracts if you haven't seen that before there are contracts where you can set how many spare parts you need and they will deliver them to you i just upped that a bit from one to two spare parts so i have i can repair these two buses consecutively here we are very short trip where, where are those cars going though interesting okay if that whatever floats your boat <laughs> uh, let's go 
to, to park here, wait for them here, and uh, open the doors. Have a great time at the beach, guys. There they are. She Hulk, right on schedule. And she's back in. She's no longer mad. I might have forgotten to turn on the air conditioning, huh? Well, that's fine. A little bit of fresh air won't hurt anybody. Let's go and explore a bit. Haven't explored this before. Oh, that's already running. Wow. Yeah, so this is, I guess, where they're going. Yeah. Level up. Shuttle service result. Let's see how the score would look like. 100% imagine that. Yeah, that doesn't happen very often. 100% <laughs> rating. Oh, this is nice. We are now level 8. Cool. Well, it's a long walk down. But I think in the end it's worth it. Oh, I love the sounds. Kailula Surf. Surfer rental. Let's go and unlock this guy. Surf rental will be available as a sightseeing tour stop and will also improve your employee satisfaction. Yeah, that one, you see? One out of two. So even though we discovered it, we had to go there and click it to unlock it. So it, discovering is different from unlocking, apparently. It's a bit more work. But kind of makes sense. Man, that's nice. Okay. Right now, the hard thing is we have to walk all the way back. Surfer's Paradise, this one. So what we can do is we can just wait until 4 p.m. for the next job. I think it, those count as two separate jobs. So we can just uh, uh, maybe leave the bus there. Walk around, tour around a little. And then we can... Fast forward a bit to 4 p.m. and then we can bring them back. Very short trip. Might be shorter than the other trips that we've had. Shortest one yet. Where did that plant come from? Was there there a while ago? That looks like <laughs> that looks like a death trap. Hmm, didn't notice that a while ago. Weird. Maybe I stra ran straight into it. I do like the landscaping though. The, the map itself very nice very scenic and very natural looking all those rocks all the different um, how do you say assets that are placed randomly just makes the map feel a lot more real whoa stay safe let's have a look at the map are there others that we can unlock yeah that gym I think we can unlock Yeah, let's try it through there, why not? Because I'm lazy. And this is a tourist bus simulator and not a walking simulator after all. And uh, later, maybe this time, let's not forget about the air conditioning. Is that moisture? Wow. That's the heater. We don't want the heater. We want the air conditioning. There you go. What's the ram air? I don't know. We'll keep it. Drive. I did not have the parking brake a while ago. Well, well, I was on park, so that shouldn't be that bad. Can I squeeze in here? Thank you. Ooh, very bumpy drive here. Oh, my wheel is acting up. It sort of realized that we were in a dirt patch. So there is a nice uh, steakhouse right there on that uh, right side of the town. That one I discovered already. This one I still haven't. But maybe I can just... I'll just loop around here. Wow, oh, traffic. What's up with you guys? We have a stop sign right there. We do have a stop sign. These guys are actually surprisingly very, very, uh, how do you say, 
I'm surprised that they follow the rules. Because in this kind of setting, I would have thought it was more like informal. Like, yes, there's a stop sign, but it's more like decoration, you know? <laughs> it's something that would uh, be nice to look at, but you hardly ever follow it to, the, to a T. Maybe it's just a slowdown, it's the most you would do if you see a stop sign like that in this kind of setting. It's not like one of those uh, like major urban cities or something. Okay, here we are. Bus stop is here. And the gym is supposedly right here around the corner. Oh, there it is. I see it. I can stop right here, maybe. For a second. Oh, come on. Okay, now what did I hit? It's impossible I hit anything here. Okay, but maybe bounding box issues. Okay, so uh, lesson learned. Don't even think about going up the curb because there might be some invisible baddies. So instead, let's just stop on the road and uh, hog this lane and uh, let everybody wait for us. Why not? Thank you. Let's go and uh, lift some weights while we're waiting for the guys. There you go. Improve employee satisfaction. I was forced to give a raise to one of the employees, one of our drivers, because they said they were not happy with the salary. And I didn't want them to leave. Right, let's go ahead and fast forward that one. Uh, I think our next, uh, skip to next appointment, yes. There you go. So where are we going now? There, okay, going back to that place, I think. Should be around 4 p.m. now if you look at the clock. Yeah, 3.45 p.m. Don't tell me we'll have to check in everybody again. Oh, yes, we will. Oh, my goodness. This is my hatest part. This is my least favorite part about shuttle services. Checking in all these passengers one by one without a QR code scanner thingy. And sometimes having a case of multiple and uh, stolen identities. Let's go to park here. Alright guys, let's keep this fast, let's make this fast. What I'll be doing is I'll just be looking at the shuttle service. 18 people went out, 18 people came in. Do you guys remember who was the... Who had a duplicate name a while ago? Is it uh, Mercedes Lopez? Okay. Not even checking the name, just checking which company. Because if you are with us, then one way or another, we would need to move you somewhere. So might as well. And this lady? No. No. Hello. Ce billet est-il valide? Merci bien. Yes. Hello. Is this ticket valid? Thank you very much. How about you, Mister? On sec. Did I not check yet? Is this ticket here richtig? Vielen Dank. We'll get there eventually, guys. Puis je roule. Merci bien. Moin. Darf ich mit diesem Ticket fahren? Danke schön. Hola. Puedo viajar con este Hola. Un millón de gracias. Hi. Ist dieses Ticket hier gut? Besten Dank. I think that's the lady. Maria something. But now I Hello. think we only have one Maria. I think they settled it themselves. There we go. So do I need to wait for you to get inside or something? Lady, go in. There you go. She might have uh, lost her way for a second there. <laughs> Needed a little bit of a nudge. Looking good, everybody? Good. All right. Let's get to it. Close the door. Make sure the air conditioning is still on. Yeah, now it's on, guys. <laughs> I know you. it was pretty hot outside. Hope you guys had a nice time on the beach. And hope you guys were able to surf. I tried surfing once. And as you can imagine, I mean, Clumsy is the name, it did not go very well. <laughs> Spent like a couple of hours 
with my instructor really getting uh, frustrated with me because no matter what he taught me no matter how hard he tried teaching me I could never learn I could not stand like you would lie down on your surfboard right if you tried this before you would be lying down on your surfboard and then you would be waiting for a wave of some sort you would be paddling and then once you have a wave once you're riding the wave or of some sort then you you push yourself up like doing a push-up and then you would be standing up and uh, like riding on a skateboard in that uh, direction like sideways for me whenever i tried pushing up i would uh, crash into something like that come on where did you come from go okay in these cases it's best to reset <laughs> ai being ai although they did have right of way but i did stop already and i was moving already and then they came out of nowhere so we can blame them maybe don't comment on that nothing happened but yeah i was pushing myself up and i could never balance myself to stand on the skateboard so i spent like i don't know three four hours trying it and i was so tired my arms were so tired and i could not even stand up once and all my other friends they were standing up they were surfing and i was like oh crap i hate this <laughs> and this is why i don't do well in sports anything that requires uh, hand eye coordination and uh, physical movements that uh, require some bit of work no i would rather drive or fly or something but myself moving eh, not the best combo and that is where the clumsy name was born <laughs> <laughs> not really in that exact instance but the trend continues so uh, it's kind of a thing as you guys might have noticed with my driving imagine that kind of skill that level of uh, physical uh, coordination or lack thereof imagine that in a, an actual physical uh, uh, encounter like sports or surfing yeah so not the best guy for that out i would say <clears throat> all good though can i just hmm can i just highlight this though on a technical level it's going on a completely different topic i just noticed the graphics of this game is really nice right but what i am amazed of is the anti-aliasing like you don't see any jagged edges at all look at that nothing even the mountain in the distance no jagged edges the anti-aliasing is immensely powerful might be part of the unreal engine and i am familiar with aliasing the jagged edges because in truxim that is the number one well maybe not number one maybe number one number one problem when it comes to graphics it's very optimized it's very smooth it's very uh, pleasing to the eyes but except for the jagged edges well that in the render distance but yeah this one very nice actually gives you a bit of a different perspective on how it could be how good it can be if there are no jagged edges on the screen that being said this game is not the best on performance yet so maybe if i remove anti-aliasing it would change everything but yeah, you either get jagged edges or you get lower frame rate. For me, I chose a bit lower frame rate because we're not playing an FPS game. So it, you can easily just slow down to 30 FPS and it would still feel amazing, look amazing. That's the good thing about simulators. And just like that, we're here. A few stories, a few uh, mishaps on the way, and we are good, everybody. Get off my bus. Nah, just kidding. Thank you for riding with clumsy buses. And uh, we hope we didn't scare you so much. Are they going down now? Yes, let me go down before you. I think she got mad there. 
<laughs> with my level of driving. Let's not look there. It's not very pleasing to the eyes how they jumble across each other. Maybe let's just tour around and see. Oh, let's go and unlock this restaurant. Bar Tapas Imas. I like that. 18 transported. No one missed. Four stars. Nice. Unlock that one. No passenger has been left behind. That's always good. 99% in one crash. Yikes. That's okay. In this hotel, do I need to discover it? One star hotel. Yeah, I did. Entering search area. No, I don't need that. Okay, good. Well, that should be good. So we should not have any other jobs now. Let me double check. If we go to scheduling. Um, yeah, there is nothing for me anymore. Perfect. Okay, great. So let's have a look again at the orders. If there are some new ones that we can take. Yeah, there are a lot. There are three. So the ones with these ribbons. These should be... Oh yeah, this is... We can't do that with our current schedule. But this other one... Same. Crap. How about this one? Still him. But yeah, this time he can take it. So you can take the MAN Lions coach. There we go. Huh, these guys we can't take. What is that? 5pm and... 8 p.m. How are we on scheduling? So 5 p.m. Ah, uh, we do have a 5 p.m. already, I think. 8 p.m. Yeah, we have lots already. Okay, fine, fine, fine. Well, we could go and hire a new driver, right? Because we are missing orders here, so might as well hire one more. I and mean, we have plenty of drivers around. This guy requires a house. Do I have a house? Offer them an apartment for relocation. Can it, Can we try that? Let's try it. Mid-century. Yeah, this one we can have. Uh, let's have a look here. Let's go and explore that bit. How does it go with the stuff here? Okay. So if you look at the map... How do you look for a house? Okay, this area, I think. And then how do you look for it? I remember we did that before. But now I can't remember a thing on how we entered something in the first place. Do we just enter a door or something? Or should there be like pop-ups? I guess there should be icons somewhere. So let's have a look. How about discovering this restaurant as well? Lajita. Oh, that's the name of the town. So that's a gym. Didn't we discover that yet? I don't think so. There you go. And how do we find an apartment? I'll try for a few minutes. If I can't, you guys help me out in the comments, okay? But you give me a chance to figure it out on my own first. Let's try. Someone looks like they've been locked out. Huh. I don't see anything. If you zoom in here, there's a uh, container there, but I don't think that's related. So how do we unlock those things? We just click that? Not really. I'm guessing there should be something saying uh, unlocked apartment or something. No, nothing's happening. If I go check this one, but I just I did that already, right? Okay. Um, let me see. If we go and enable the tutorial maybe will it say something or not okay fine but yeah we can hire a driver and then we can we do have one apartment that's open we can do that and then we can assign them something and then we can you guys can help me out and help me look for we've been there already 
help me look for more apartments for drivers yes entering search area Let's see us running around here gta style <laughs> goodness i told you this would not be a uh, walking simulator but i think i it ended up that way anyway maybe it is like a region and then you would need to find the spot okay and it's somewhere there in that area but it won't tell you exactly where so you'll have to find it on your own i guess that's how it goes left it again so maybe we just continue looking for stuff here lady where is this sitting like that okay still nothing cannot see it we've been there already in Lalajita maybe somewhere here in the back nah okay this is outside already this is quite nice isn't it having this aspect of not only driving and not even only caring for your uh, company but also caring for your employees don't tell me this is the apartment <laughs> it's not very uh that's not very nice to live in i would imagine we've been here before but maybe there is something at the back that we haven't seen how about those stuff or how about these guys how about these ones those look like apartments yeah could be anyway all right but yeah i don't think we'll have enough time otherwise uh, to spend all the time running around and uh, just fumbling around so you guys help me out and uh, in the meantime we will get that driver and then we will assign him to those new routes so where was it driver um, job market this guy Enes Grun very high level 44 67.8 though actually you know what it's not that good I mean th this guy is a lot better although we need to pay him a lot more but yeah I think yeah let's go with Isa 1650 fine i'll meet that ah from tomorrow why tomorrow come on okay but maybe we can get some orders in already let's see mm. this one is 83 she should be in by then uh where is isa there she goes and we there perfect i get the ma lines coach and uh, this one other one you can assign to her as well perfect and Get that assigned uh, that one too right perfect good so yeah that kind of works out that one needs to be prepared the VDL uh, let's go and do that there's our income 144 versus 40 We're earning 100k per week goodness that's great but we have to do some repairing hmm no appointments available at this day. 23 hours, 22 minutes. That's fine. Because the next trip is still on Friday. What does this say? Ah, crap. Yeah, they'll miss a lot if this is happening. Sunday, 15.15. Okay, one sec, guys. This is the 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 company owner part. We'll have to do some scheduling. We'll have to remove that. Um, I think it's the... Is it Frederick? I think it's Frederick. Yeah, with the Futura. So we'll switch it with that one. Right. And I think that's good enough already. So if we go for uh workshop select that 
fix this. There you go. So you see there are no jobs anymore that are assigned. So we can actually have it repaired all the way we want. Like so. So repair the bus totally, fully. Because everything is broken on this bus now. And then this one, indicators and body damage. Um, Friday. No slots available there. Okay, on Sunday, you need the thing at, you see, that's going to take a while. Sunday, Monday, there is every day a trip for this one. So I think we need to make it Monday, starting at 2 p.m. Ah, uh, that will coincide with something. Yeah. If we remove the body damage, that will only take 53 minutes. So that means Monday at 2 p.m. after the trip can actually repair that. Yeah, that couldn't help. There you go. It's a little bit of scheduling so that no existing jobs are impacted. And still, we have everything moving. There you go. So yeah, let's leave it there, guys. But yes, wow, floating phone. Uh, <laughs> that's scary. Let's leave it there, guys. I know not a lot of driving in this episode, but I wanted to show you a few of the different uh, things you can do in this game as well. So not just driving, but managing and exploring as well. So hope you enjoyed that. Oh, scary. Uh, video? This video? Thanks for watching. Have a nice day. Let me know what you think in the comments. And if you did like it, please don't forget hit the thumbs up button and let me know what you think, okay? Catch you soon and clumsy bussing. See you in the next one.